Determined the fuses were good, so my next test was going to be the washer pump itself. Now, if I get access to the washer pump and I disconnect the wiring, I can probe each end of that electrical connector and I can actually tell with the test light if I'm getting power to the washer pump itself. And the thought process is fairly simple and straightforward. If the electricity is getting to the washer pump and it's still not turning on and pumping washer fluid, that just means you have a bad pump. Now, doing this by myself on my own car was a little bit of a stretch, but I managed to uh, open the door and reach uh, kind of through the, the open area there. And uh, I've got long enough arms where I managed to do it myself and film it. I might add, uh, but sometimes you might need an extra person to check things like this, just depending on what component you're trying to test and where in the vehicle it is.